In this video, I will show you how to set custom alarm on iPhone with iOS 18. This way you can set any music track or any song as the alarm sound on your iPhone. So let's get started. First, if you have your music track on your iPhone, then you need to move that music track to the files app. But if you don't have music track, then you can get one from the sites like Pixabay or Ben Sound for completely free. So let's open the browser and open pixabay.com. Now on the website homepage, just click on the drop down that says all images and then tap on music. Now in the search bar, just enter the type of the music that you want to download. You can enter type like piano or positive, motivational or just or just any type of music that you like. Let's enter piano and tap search. Now here are all the music tracks related to piano. You can just listen to the track and then download the one that you like. So to download the track, just tap on download icon and then tap on download. Now this has downloaded the music track. Now tap on this arrow with the blue circle and then tap on downloads. Now here is the file relaxing piano. Just click on it to open. Now tap on share and then tap on save to files. Now select the location where you want to save this music track. I will put into my music folder. You can rename the track and then tap on save. So now our music track is ready. Now in order to change this music track to ringtone, we are going to make use of GarageBand. GarageBand comes preloaded with iPhone or iPad. But if you don't have this application, then you can download it from App Store for completely free. So first open GarageBand app on your iPhone or iPad. Now scroll to the left or right and then tap on audio recorder. Tap OK. Now tap on timeline icon and then tap on plus icon next to the timeline to change the duration. Now tap on 8 bars and let's make it to 30. So this will change the length of the timeline. You can keep to 30 or 40 as per your wish. Tap back and done. As you can see the timeline ring as you can see, timeline length is now 30 seconds. Once done, just tap on this loop like icon at the top. Then tap files. Tap browse. And now look for the music track that we just downloaded. So this is the track relaxing piano. Just wait for a couple of seconds. And now this is added to this pop-up. Just long press on this music track and then drag it to the timeline. Now we have added the music track to timeline. Next, tap on this down arrow and then tap on my songs. Now just wait for the processing to get completed. Once done, just long press on this mysong.band and then tap on share. Now tap ringtone, tap continue. You can rename the ringtone as you like. Let's rename to piano new. 
and then tap on export. It is exporting the music track as ringtone. As you can see the ringtone export is successful. Tap on OK. And now open the clock app on your iPhone. You can create a new alarm by tapping on plus icon at the top right side or you can edit the existing alarm using edit button. So I will edit the existing alarm. To do that first tap on edit. Select any of the alarm of which you want to change the sound. Now tap on sound. Scroll up. Under ringtones you will find the ringtone that we just created which is piano new. It's just a typo error so it is showing as piano NEA. Just tap on it. So new soundtrack will be converted to the ringtone and that you can add as a custom alarm on your iPhone. So that is how you can set custom alarm on iPhone with iOS 18. If you find the video helpful then like the video, share with your friends and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.